What small habit, if practiced every day, can significantly improve one's quality of life? Stretching. Yoga and meditation sounds cheesy but it's been so great for can start by teaching yourself the sun salutation from YouTube, which is a series of movements that takes about 10 minutes, then progress onto more challenging videos. I use an app called Insight Timer that has loads of guided meditations for the start of the new year so one better time to make commitments. Also at the end of the day I run through a gratitude checklist on my head for even small things that I can be happy about like today I ate 3 meals, my house is warm etc. Write down your expenses for the day. This could get as simple or as fancy as you like Excel file or notebook pen, categorize or just a simple list. Helps you know how your budget is going, and if you want, you can use the data to understand your spending patterns. At the very least, you practice mindfulness around your spending. I have been doing this for 15 years now and have a really clear picture of my spending patterns, how I need to prepare my budget, what my financial goals are what expenses matter and what don't in terms of affecting budget. While exercise is a great way to start the day, sometimes you just don't feel like it but the time still needs to be spent productively. I installed a randomizer app on my phone that has so far 8 activities to spend the 30 minutes each day I'm getting up earlier to be more productive and healthy run, read per end, not computer, clean, home improvement, learn, yoga, write journal or work on an article, rest. Unless I strongly feel like doing one of the activities, I randomly select an activity each morning. Not necessarily a daily habit, more monthly habit but putting money into savings. Even if it's a small amount. Getting used to putting money away each month is a good habit. Even if it's 25 pounds each month at first to get used to it and then increasing it over time is and when you find you can manage it. Even an amount of 25 pounds amounts to 300 pounds each year. The way that I look at it is that I'd quite happily spend 25 pounds on a good size takeaway so why would I not happily invest that into my future? Meditating daily for 10 minutes improved my quality of life immensely to start I would recommend a guide in meditation through apps or videos. And don't be discouraged if you have racing thoughts and can't calm them down, that is part of the process and everyone experienced or experiences that. I always felt like I needed the meditation the most when it was most difficult. Try to get rejected once a day. Not for anything in particular or even particularly important. You'll succeed less than you think. Advice from an old professor. He was a photographer and would try to get rejected getting into all kinds of cool places. Got into a lot of cool places. Making tomorrow better the night before. Lay out clothes, pack lunches, pack the bags going to work or school, and figure out what is for dinner so you can thought put it in the slow cooker etc. when you get up. That makes the morning a lot less stressed and that makes the day go better. Make your bed. Your bed book could 1,703,775,580 SR81. If you are trying to form new habits, writing down your progress helps immensely. It helped me form a routine of reading. I just noted down the number of pages I read daily. It is a whole other thing that I dropped off that wagon. Looking for a restart in the new year. Cheers. Cleaning and tidying up your living space. Even if it's just getting rid of the dust on some shelf or putting one book in your bookshelf. After soul times, your living space is much more cleaner than it used to be and it's better for your health and mental health. Skincare. A simple routine cleanser, moisturizer, sunscreen makes a big difference over time. You look healthier and more vibrant and be more protected against skin cancer and signs of aging and can experience mental health benefits from the act of self-care. 10k steps a day no matter how to do it. Go for a run to do a quickie, take the dog for a long walk. Walk on the spot during meetings or when watching TV this may feel silly at first but once it's part of your routine you'll feel so much better for it. Meditation daily will have a profound effect on you. It's a superpower but not like muscle exercise. You don't need to up reps or add more time. 10 minutes a day and you will see improvements on focus, sleep, pain, and blood pressure. Stretching flanking. I'm a big guy 6 feet 5 inches and 270 pounds and man, it's changed everything from sex to just enjoying activities. I never realized how stiff low core strength I was and how much it was impacting areas of my life. Ask any recovering alcoholic or drug addict sobriety. Practice that every day, and life gets better. Not to say that being drunk isn't fun, but that's not what I mean. Being drunk is fun being in so much. Make your bed in the morning. Gives you an immediate sense of accomplishment. Makes your bedroom clean, which helps with your mood. 
and having a crisp made bed to get into at night softens even the hardest days. Live by the rule if something takes two minutes or less to accomplish, just do it. You'll notice how many things are really not that bad, but also how much accomplishing things is just a mental block. Live by the rule if something takes two minutes or less to accomplish, just do it. You'll notice how many things are really not that bad, but also how much accomplishing things is just a mental block. Spend half an hour in the nearest public park, if you have one. If you don't, then just spend half an hour walking around your neighborhood. Most importantly turn off your phone while you do this. Connecting with others, whether it be acquaintances, friends, family, or people you see on the street. Looking people in the eyes, smiling, and saying hello is good for you and helps mental health. I have been bodybuilding for 10 years. It only takes 30 minutes to 1 hour 4 days a week. Get in a routine in an average of 10-20 minutes a day and you can be top 10 of the population in physique. Rinse your mouth after every meal. You should not brush your teeth for at least half an hour after eating anything, because your tooth enamel is still soft, but just give it a good rinse. Taking a social media break every now and then. If you feel overwhelmed or stressed when on after being on your social media, then it's time for a mental health break from the socials. Stretching every day, tidying up the home before bed. Noticing emotions and body language of those around you and acting accordingly just being a mindful person and always really. Yoga. Even 5 minutes of yoga has an impact. Now in my 6th year of daily practice I can confidently say it's improved my life physically, mentally, spiritually and emotionally. Thinking twice before buying anything. If you can get to a mindset where you don't want stuff and tad and instead save that money, you'll be setting up the future you nicely. Drinking a glass of lukewarm water with a bit of lemon juice in the morning aids digestion, boosts hydration, and provides a vitamin C boost, helping kickstart your metabolism. To think about all the ways society has wronged you, your parents and anyone you know. To know that you are a victim and your failures are not your fault. For 10 minutes. Truth being told, almost anything. Learning a new skill changing habits, changing a mindset. I believe they can all be done if a person was to stick with a daily routine. Morning exercise. Just 10 minutes of exercise each morning can boost energy, improve mood, and promote better health, leading to a more productive and positive day. If you have a desk job that leads to extended periods of sitting down, try to find 20-30 minutes even in intervals to stretch your legs and get a brisk walk in. Allocating time away from screens and digital devices daily can reduce eye strain and mental fatigue, leading to increased productivity and better mental health. Healthy eating. Incorporating more fruits and vegetables into your daily diet can improve overall health, provide essential nutrients, and boost energy levels. Spending a small amount of time each day learning something new, like a language or a hobby, can enhance cognitive abilities and personal satisfaction. Daily practice of not reading the comments and political threads instantly improves mental health and saves countless hours of pointless arguments. I walk from my apartment to the bus stop, and then walk from the bus stop to work. It's a great little stroll and I get my exercise in before work. Making an effort to connect with friends or family every day, even through a quick message or call, can improve relationships and emotional health. Moisturizing your skin You have no idea how many skin problems, even ones you might think are unrelated, will be tackled if you just do this one thing. Writing down three things you're grateful for every day can increase positivity, enhance well-being, and shift focus from negatives to positives. Whenever you leave an area, look around real quick for trash or other things you can take with you. Makes keeping things clean so much easier. Dedicating time to read each day even if it's just for 15 minutes, can expand knowledge, improve memory and concentration, and reduce stress. Positive thinking, or observing one's thoughts as neither good nor bad. Just listening and letting them pass if it does not serve you. Mindfulness meditation. It can calm you down when doing it and it can give you the necessary skills to handle stressful situations. Mountain climbers for 3 minutes once per day. It will vastly improve your core strength and stamina in all physical activities. Meditation exercise and healthy eating. There really isn't any magic hack to this, you just have to take care of yourself. Counting your blessings. As I'm falling asleep I give thanks for my day and all I have in life. When I wake I do the same. My cardiologist recommended walking 30 minutes per day. When I was doing this, I never felt better. New Year's resolution. Consistently drinking enough water throughout the day can improve skin health, aid digestion, and increase energy levels. Stretching yoga and exercise. 10-20 minutes a day can make all the difference in the world. 
even if it isn't every single day, going to bed at the same time every day, including weekends. Harder than it sounds, more powerful than you think. Exercise. Reading. Eating healthy. Laughing and socialize. Try to scale it as small to suit you. Replacing all soda and juice with water. Way less dental hygiene issues and you'll effortlessly lose weight. Calisthenics. You don't need to go to the gym to get into good shape. You just need patience and dedication. Drink a glass of water when you wake up. Hydrates your body and gets the morning bowel movement going. Don't overstimulate your genitals while masturbating for a while and your sensitivity will improve. Breathing exercises and meditation, 30-ish minutes every day. I'm less prone to things like road rage. Shower. Or, if that's too hard some days, at the very least wash your face and brush your teeth. Morning prayer. It will give peace in your mind. Morning exercise and try to eat healthy food. Breathing. If you don't breath then you won't have much quality of life. Or, any life. Start every day by making your bed. See how productive you become after. I swear by it. You can try mindful meditation. It can help you reduce the stress, enhance focus. Give yourself a bedtime and a wake up time that gives you 7 to 8 hours of sleep. Not buying snacks and therefore not eating snacks. Will do wonders long term. Make your bed couch especially if you work study in an area with such objects. Devote 5 to 30 minutes to anything useful but something you were too lazy to do. Helping others without expecting anything in return. Hard. Yet, worth it. Wake up early in the morning. Doing exercise. Eat fresh and healthy food. Make it a habit to drink a glass of water every hour from 9 to 5. Exercise. Diet. Meditation. Hygiene. Style. Posture. Smiling.